Nadine, to answer your question, when is the right? When did I think it was the right time to take Aflatoon forward? I think um, if I'm looking back at Aflatoon, I knew the right time to take it forward was when children were actually saving uh, in rural India, and we after. Aflatoon actually got thrown out of the first district it started in uh, with schools and I said okay if we be mainly because of political reasons and at that time it was a very fascist party called BJP and they did not want an organization like us to be in that particular district so they cut all our activities and instead of saying oh my god I said why not let's evaluate let's we didn't have money but we said let's try to document what we have and see whether the first batch that we started where the program really was just an idea or whether it had had any impact or not we did the research i think a year after because we wanted uh, uh, to sort of have a gap and i found that almost 70 percent of the children were still saving 90 plus percent remembered the songs the messages and everything that went with it and given that it was such an abrupt exit the fact that it had had such an impact was enough for me to say that there is something in this concept to build on further and that's when i said okay if there is something Plus, it was a very practical point that was in rural India. I had moved to the Netherlands, so it was more a personal thing. I was like, let's try to see if we can take this on at a global level. And another major criticism which always comes is that uh, something will work in India is definitely not going to work in Zimbabwe. So then the next part of it was let's try to pilot this concept in countries where it will never ever normally work so therefore the first pilot took on Zimbabwe with hyperinflation it took on Serbia it took on Argentina so really really countries where we said we are going to fail nine out of ten and that was sort of uh, Uganda and and that's where we sort of said okay if we are taking it on let's see we did a pilot for a year and the first model was like everything India based halfway through the pilot we realized we have to make it a global model at the end of the pilot we realized we had to contextualize our material to make it very regional so it was a very nice process but through it all we documented everything and that's when we at the end of the pilot thought okay now is the time where we can actually be ready to take it to scale to a lot more countries and I think what helped that or the inflection point was when after a year pretty much all the partners they had a long list of criticism the most important being that we were not going to pay them to carry on a platoon where they wanted to beat me up not riff but really they were like how can you not give us money to implement I said if there is value in the concept we should not be giving money to take the concept forward that's the true test of a concept and there was a lot of discussion because then I was going against traditional mindsets of saying you pay me and I'm going to implement and then we'll become and saying no to it saying let's take it for the concept itself and we will just give the technical stuff so everyone was ready to beat me up and I said okay if that's the case then we won't take this forward and I remember after a heated two hour discussion when I said we stop our flatoon if you don't believe in the concept we don't take it forward there was pin drop silence and everyone said no who said we are not taking it forward of course we will take it forward and to me I said okay the concept has reached a place where now people are going to look at it and since then there was pretty much no turning back of course we had to learn a lot in terms of creating the systems the materials the entrepreneurial things had to be you know put all the things in place but I think that was where it sort of went and every Every concept going global, I think there's an inflection point and then you know it's going to just take off. And I thought it has reached it for Aflatun. We actually have a summit in April 
if you could come for that you would see it i think at that summit people are going to say child finance is ours and we will take it forward and i think that will be the inflection point for child finance where it will stop being the secretariat pushing and people taking it on as their own